Hi Aquarius, welcome back to Omkara Tarot and let's do your energy check-in for the weekend. Uh, Aquarius, this is for the weekend of the 16th to the 18th of October, 16th, 17th, 18th and these are general collective readings Aquarius, will not uh, resonate with each and every one of you. So take what works for you, okay? Leave the rest. So let's begin. Dear God, Goddesses, Angels, Spirit Guides, please bless this reading for Aquarius and send them the messages they need to hear the most at this time. Thank you. So Aquarius, let's uh, take an Angel Blessing card before we start the reading. Let's stop it with a blessing or an advice from my Angels. So my Angels, what do you have for Aquarius now? Blessing, advice, okay, thank you. Forgiveness. Who do you need to forgive, uh, Aquarius? Is there somebody around you or is it yourself that you have to forgive? Sometimes this card Aquarius also uh, kind of indicates that there is, sometimes we go into uh, situations where we start blaming ourselves. So it's very important to kind of, one never makes a mistake knowingly, right Aquarius? So if you have done something uh, which you are, you kind of keep telling yourself it was your fault, it's time to forgive yourself and if there is something else or somebody else that you feel you need to forgive, I think this would be a good weekend to kind of bring an apology or get an apology from, okay? So let's see. While I was doing uh, your pre-shuffle also with these cards, the page of cups came out which is also another card indicating the same thing. So let's see why, what is this forgiveness uh, related to Aquarius and uh, why you need it. So welcome back all my subscribers, welcome back to Omkara Tarot, thank you so much for all your support and uh, if you are new here, we welcome you to the Omkara family. Join us, subscribe to the channel if you enjoy these readings, we meet here monthly, weekly, weekends as well, so we welcome you in. This is going to be a mini read just to check your weekend energies and I have a king of wands here as well Aquarius what of my deck let's see what these cards want to tell us first card I have here uh, Aquarius for you is the knight of pentacles so something is slowing down or has slowed down there is a bit of stagnancy here and uh, but now I think you are or maybe, maybe something had stagnated in your life but I see you now uh, Aquarius not uh, focusing so much on the stuff which went wrong. I see you now turning around to see the value of things or appreciating things and you know turning around to see the two cups which are still full of love in your life. You are taking stock of all the investment that has been put maybe in a relationship, maybe in, yeah, this is with a soulmate maybe you had some discord with in the past and uh, now you're kind of re-evaluating this relationship thinking of all that has been put in all the investment over the years maybe all the seeds that have been sown uh, and it's a precious have you know thing to look forward to a harvest um, maybe at one point you felt that this person was maybe more like a dictator or was emotionless or was trying to control you but uh, now I see you trying to be strong. Yes, uh, at one point maybe this relationship burdened you. You thought it was too much to handle. This could be in a relationship, meaning a family situation, could be a marriage, could be a long-term partner. At one time maybe you thought this was kind of very, very um, burdening to you. But I see you now kind of gathering up your strength and uh, I see you now making plans for the future. Right? You have the world in your hands, you are looking out to see, okay, so maybe this is not so bad. Uh, it may have sometimes made you happy, sometimes not so happy. But uh, now I think you're seeing things from a higher ground Aquarius this weekend. And you realize that this is not really worth a chapter closing down in your life. Uh, the sun card in reverse is never a bad card. It's like, it's okay, it's not that happy, but it's not bad either. So you're realizing, yes, the situation is not that bad, bad either. Yes, sometimes this person does uh, do silly things, maybe, you know, talks rudely or uh, is not very, 
doesn't show their emotions very much or sometimes comes across as ungrounded or you know all the negative things one thinks of the spouse <laughs> but uh, right now I think you are uh, kind of picking up your passion once again you are realizing that no this is a, a temporary phase and there's been too much put into this relationship to just kind of put it by the wayside and you also I think realizing that uh, why this discord has been why you both have uh, maybe sometimes uh, you you know you're taking evaluation of this relationship you're trying to see why this person sometimes come, comes across as selfish then you're realizing that maybe you have also hidden your emotions many a times and pulled back your love from this person but uh, that little bit of unhappiness is not worth uh, you know closing down a chapter with this person yes now you're trying to see or if, like all the aspects of this relationship like everything in, in clarity you know. and now I think you realize all the good good that comes with this relationship as well yeah like I mean earlier maybe you were confused but now I see you seeing a lot of these this confusion as actually blessings in your life for stability which is nice and you I think yeah you're trying to kind of uh, get over your minor irritations that you may have had and you're trying to find happiness and yes the wheel of fortune is now in your favor which means once you forgive whatever has happened between the two of you or those minor irritations and you are also realizing that you may have played a big big part in those uh, disruptions which have happened and you're forgiving not only this person but also yourself and noticing how things are now changing for the better let's see what's happening on your weekend yes uh, Aquarius I think you have you will be healing this uh, weekend you've taken a lot of time to think about all this you have had a lot of time to recuperate and go over this family situation which is you and your person I think and you are finding value in uh, having this long-term partner this relationship something that promises to be there for you forever and ever after right I think this weekend you're going to drop all your defenses and be more open and vulnerable. Let's see, Four of Swords Spirit, Four of Swords, one more and the Ten of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles and the Seven of Wands very nice oh beautiful okay so this weekend you're going to feel rather happy and victorious you know why because all this time Aquarius that you've taken for reflection and resting or whatever you've realized what was bringing imbalance to your relationship and now you're making a conscious decision to move away from all this trouble time and move into happier times this is relating to this commitment that you have with maybe a person you see what are the things that didn't make you happy and you have now decided to bring justice and balance back into your life with this partner of yours I see this weekend both of you dropping your uh, defenses both of you not being so guarded anymore and guess what Aquarius I need a thumbs up right now finally you get the lovers right so I think this is going to be a weekend where you're going to reconnect with your partner forgive all that happened in the past and uh, value what you have right there with you in front of you okay so this is going to be a great weekend for you uh, after you kind of forgive yourself yes I told you there was a king of wands bottom of my deck somebody is ready for action yes if there have been any broken hearts in the past you are going to get victory and you are going to now move forward into this ten of cups and I have the lovers once again for you so all this heartbreak is going to be uh, talked about or left out in the backyard now after this forgiveness comes and things are going to get much better all right so that's all I have for you Aquarius have a beautiful beautiful wonderful uh, weekend and if you haven't forgiven yourself or your partner I think take some time out and think about it okay and I look forward to a great weekend Love and light. Take care. Namaste.